Congressman Costa, thank you for uh, joining us. This is a pre-recorded um, session because you were not available uh, Tuesday evening. Uh, so first question is, uh, what are we doing with Stinger missiles? Uh, and are we delivering Stinger missiles to Ukrainians to stop the aerial assault, assault of Ukraine, especially Kiev? Yes, so uh, we have done so prior to the invasion by this uh, pariah, President Putin, who's decided to uh, invade a sovereign nation. Um, and that number has only increased by tenfold. Uh, good for um, the current situation is that the supply chain from uh, Poland and from Romania has still remained open. And uh, as we speak daily, uh, literally hundreds of Stinger missiles and javelins, which are, are really targeted for the tank warfare, uh, warfare is, um, is going into Ukraine and that will continue. And President Zelensky, when we spoke with him Saturday morning with a bipartisan joint session of House and Senate, um, again, pleaded for a no-fly zone. He pleaded for additional uh, military equipment, thanked us for what we've done and uh, indicated that he thought he had an agreement with the president of Poland uh, if we could backfill, and we've agreed to backfill um, for the Polish Air Force to take those uh, Russian air aircraft that the Ukrainian uh, pilots are already trained in and, and try to move them as quickly as we can to the Ukrainian pilots. And then we would uh, resupply uh, the Polish Air Force with F-16s.